Hi, I'm Warren B, and you're watching my DVD. Thank you very much. I um, was born in a place called Guruk in Scotland, but I'm also half Italian. First met Michael Johansson, and he was working in Lapland, and we've been working with lots of big producers like Thomas Allstrand, who won a Grammy, and he's done so much work I can't even, I've not got the time to go through it all. Steve Evans, um, who's also part of Storm Studios, and also has a studio in Wales. He's done a lot of stuff for Boney M and Lulu. Also worked with Peter Malmrup, he's also part of Storm Studios. We've also worked with another producer in Malmo, and that guy's called Johan Bayerholm. Yeah, is that enough? Well, we're in Stockholm and we're just at Storm Studios and we're recording one of the songs, Like Honey, as you can see here. And we wrote it about five months ago. Me, Michael, Steve, Thomas and Peter, there's quite a lot of writers. Which foot there for so Pure is a song that's based on a true experience, seen a girl on the street. Every day you look for her face, she disappeared without a trace. She's got a smile that I can't forget, I've got to find her. Which way did she go? What's her name? No one knows. I think about her all the time. Studio, we were recording a song called Can Before the Storm, which is actually my first ballad. I'm an opera singer. Fantastic. Sometimes in life, things don't go your way. But before the storm, there's a calm. Even if you're wrong, even if I'm right, even if we Funny story, we were, me and Michael just went to a meeting and we were walking back to the hotel and we just bumped into this, this guy that we met at the studio, we bumped into the guy called Dennis Morgan and he's a huge songwriter, written songs for George Michael and even stuff for Eric Clapton, massive, massive songwriter and he just met him on the street and he just said let's, let's write a song together so he came to the hotel, he came here. I'd like to say hi to the people up where the ice is. Uh Freeze your ice right off. <laughs> yeah, yeah, up in the elevator, you know. So Dennis Morgan, hey, everyone. Hello. Warren B here in Stockholm again, as you can see. And we are in a recording studio. Fuck. <gasps> Oh my god. Now, we 
we were filming, you saw what happened. It fell from uh, eight floors and it's still fine. I really don't believe the phone is working. Oh my God. I really thought my phone was dead. <laughs> Look, absolutely fine, no problem. Isn't this the best phone you've ever... Yeah. I mean, it's, it's absolutely fine. There's not even a scratch on it. This right. is... Oh, that whole thing? Yeah, one of those. One of these? Yeah. And what do I do? Is I chew it? No, 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 no. You wouldn't want to do Show that. Me. You just... You, do it. you lift your... Lift like this. It snooze. Oh, and then you put it on like that. I don't know if I can put it... The snink. The smell. <laughs> smells really smells. bad. It smells of... Tobacco. Smelly feet or something. Come on. Ooh, oh, shit. Right. Uh, <laughs> I look like a vampire. It's gonna stay after a while, I guess. Does it? Yeah. What is the point of that? <laughs> I don't Am know. I supposed to break it? No, no, no. It's supposed to be like that. Don't you feel like an idiot? Like that? You see, I get a hole in my lips. You can't really tell that I have one. No. You, know. you can see it on me, can't you? Yeah, you have a bum here. Um, it's kind of nippy. Kind of <laughs> Does it stain already? It's... Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like it's stinging. Oh. Uh. Right, you lasted for a couple. Uh, at oh. least one minute. Uh. Well done. You need water. Uh. It. Yes. Try it. You be taking snooze. Well, that is the most disgusting thing. It's stinging all my the gums. Oh. Guys, I'm gonna kill you. Uh. Guys. <laughs>